Cuisinart Toa 60 Air Fryer Toaster Oven Review The Cuisinart Toa 60 Air Fryer Toaster Oven provides something different from its competition by having seven cooking functions, one of which is air fried. Its design is more mini oven than an air fryer and its analog controls might not be liked by everyone. Value adding features such as the lack of preset options for air fried food are missing in this model. We tested the product and achieved crispy chicken wings and golden fries, alongside satisfactory results from other settings. The Cuisinart Air Fryer Mini Oven is fairly sizable, with its dimensions measuring 35 x 40 by 31 cm and 14 by 16 by 15.5 inches in the US model. It requires 100 mm of clearance on each side for safety purposes and has a weight of 21 pounds for the US model and 12 kg for the UK one. It has 6 additional cooking modes that could reduce the number of small appliances needed in your kitchen. But it may be too heavy if you plan to move it frequently between cupboards and countertops. This model has a 17 liter capacity and is wider than most comparable models on the market, increasing the quantity you can cook in one go. We tested this appliance and determined it can accommodate 2 to 2.5 portions of fries per run with adequate crispiness. The Cuisinart Air Fryer Mini Oven is accompanied by three non-stick trays, an air fryer basket, a baking tray, and an oven rack. Unfortunately, none are dishwasher safe. The wire basket for the air fryer can be difficult to clean after cooking foods such as chicken which are sticky or fatty. This model does come with a removable crumb tray, though. 4 control dial timers, temperature, function, and toasting level can be easily adjusted on the front of the windowed over. The timer is set from 0 to 60 minutes while the temperature can between 250 to 450 degrees Fahrenheit. It is important to remember that analog controls can lead to imprecise measurements. Thus it is recommended to supervise the food while it is being cooked. This model does not have a preheat setting nor a shake or shop reminder when air frying which are typically available in dedicated air fryers for even crispiness. We tested the various functions of the Cuisinart Air Fryer Toaster Oven, such as air fringing home-style sweet potato fries, frozen thick cut fries, and chicken wings, baking a cupcake, and using the roast and pizza settings to cook a pizza. Following Cuisinart's instructions, we set the temperature of the mini oven to 440 for our frozen thick cut fries. We let the oven preheat for 5 minutes and then cooked the fries for 12 minutes, shuffling them in the middle. After 12 minutes, some of the fries were slightly overdone and dry as a result of releasing heat while shuffling them. We followed the air fryer specific cooking instructions on the fries packaging, which indicated cooking at 350OF without preheating. Although it was a long process of 15 minutes, the end result was golden and crispy fries. We tested the air fryer's capacity for chicken wings, which we were pleased to discover could hold 9 comfortably. We suggest avoiding layering too many in order to achieve crispy results. Following the company's guidelines, we set the temperature to 390 Celsius and kept the wings in for 25 minutes with a coating of 0.5 tablespoons of oil, stirring halfway. In only 25 minutes, we had a plate full of moist and crispy wings that would have taken at least an hour to cook in an oven. The air fryer has a front window that can fog up with condensation, which appears to be a common issue. The manual briefly mentions this but does not provide solutions. This problem has been noticed with other windowed air fryers. Although it happens more frequently with the Cuisinart air fryer toaster oven's large glass pane. Additionally, users have noticed steam escaping from the left-hand side of the door. For our third test, we made home-style sweet potato fries. We sliced them thin, dusted them with corn flour, and lightly drizzled half a tablespoon oil over the fries. Before cooking at 390O for 14 minutes and shaking halfway through. The results were good, some of the ends were burned, however, they remain crispy on the exterior and soft on the interior. Sweet potatoes are not typically suited to air frying due to their softer texture and structure, so these results weren't unexpected. We tested the roast and pizza function by purchasing a pre-made pizza base with mushrooms and subjecting it to 350 of for 10 minutes, eliminating the need for preheating. Despite the time saved being minimal, it yielded positive results, the pizza came out perfectly and was even throughout. This is in contrast to the occasional irregularity of domestic oven results which can be soggy, 